Hey everybody, this is Christine here again at Express Yourself Ceramics. We went on a tour last night and we ended up getting a whole bunch of new stuff. This is a little pot. You can see from my hand size, it's not huge. This is an African violet pot, as is this. And inside I have unicorn horn for this right here, which I will attach a little bit later. Absolutely gorgeous, massive unicorn. I have a dish with a lid that has the grapes on it. I would say that's a grape dish or a butter dish or something like that because it's very round. This dish here has grapes all the way around it, all the way around, not just in the front. Then we have a pie dish, very cute, I love it. You can cook your pie in it and then you can have a lid to cover it up. We got one birdhouse, and he is gorgeous. Okay, we got a small snail, but unfortunately in the travel, his other piece broke off. I'll have to put that back on. We have a gorgeous mama baby eagle. Unfortunately, one toe broke off. I hope I can find it. Okay, this one is for my dad, probably. Another eagle, absolutely gorgeous. I'm terrified of breaking it. <laughs> so detailed, so detailed. Okay, and then I have two horses coming out of the rocks. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, I started off thinking, oh, I'm not sure I like that one. And then I realized it was a Norman Rockwell, circa 1975. This is a stein. Okay. Obviously the lid comes off, but it is the full Norman Rockwell stein. This is a worm or caterpillar of some kind. Um, then we've got uh, Native American uh, with an eagle, or it looks like an eagle at least. Okay. And then we'll walk over here. All right. We have a couple of cactus uh, planters here. And then a couple of mini cactus planters there. We have a dog and a cat together. I think they're just darling. I love it. Okay. We have the, this is a chess set, but it's all the same uh, piece. It's all the same Indian. So I don't have quite, excuse me, Native American. It's from a set called Cowboys and Indians. Uh, we've got a cute little bunny here, and a little kid here, and uh, salt and pepper shakers, all kinds of stuff. Oh, and this snail here has uh, one missing again, but I hope I could find it. And then it has a pot in it. Okay. Oh, Serafina, here's one of the lids. Oh, you, well, that's right. Here's one of the other stein lids. We're trying to figure out which one that goes to. And then the bird. Okay, we have the two of the Last Supper scene. Okay, and then unfortunately this is my biggest accident that happened during the transportation, and that is that the wing broke off. But this is a stunning, beautiful piece. Mama feeding her baby, the nest and everything. Okay, and then what everybody's dying to see. Steins. All right, yes, I have a bunny. He's adorable. I got him a little while ago. Uh, another giant snail but with the pot cut out. You can see he is absolutely massive. Um, and then we've got a castle stein. I'm not gonna show you the whole 3D view. Okay, I don't even know what this one's called. Uh, stein. Oh, and he has um, probably medieval or something because there's a dragon right here. And that's the handle. There's his head. Okay. And the dragon is the handle. All right. And this one for all you horse lovers out there. Okay. And then I've got a wizard up here as the lid for this stein. And there's a viking there, a wizard on the other side. Okay. We have... The Confederate, 1776. Okay. 
We have Native American with a wolf headdress. Okay, we have the jungle uh, stein here. I may actually have that mold here because Sunny had one before I got it. All right, and this one is for all the cowboys out there. And we have Moby Dick, Captain Ahab, all right, and an elephant. Woohoo! Sorry I couldn't do a reveal this time. There was just too much stuff. I would have had to reveal it from my truck. So we unloaded and loaded up all the tables. We just got done with a big party, and now we got empty boxes. And the tables are full of things that I'm going to be cleaning and firing, ready for you guys to purchase. Woo-woo!